We turn now to this incredible breaking news. History was made in space. The first spacewalk ever by a civilian. Trevor Alt is here with more on that. Good morning, Trevor. Imagine being this person. Yeah, it has been really unbelievable to watch Rebecca, and we've been watching it play out live from space, along with millions of people who've been tuning into the stream. This heart-stopping moment as mission commander and billionaire Jared Isaacman climbed out of that open hatch into space. There is our first view of the forward hatch. This morning, history in space exploration with the first spacewalk from a commercial aircraft. Back at home, we all have a lot of work to do, but from here, Earth sure looks like a perfect world. Billionaire Jared Isaacman and engineer Sarah Gillis, the first humans on a private space flight to walk in space. Part of the Polaris Dawn space mission in partnership with Elon Musk's SpaceX. Three. Launching from Kennedy Space Center in Florida earlier this week after unfavorable weather caused weeks of delays. Very, very excited to fly on my favorite Dragon spacecraft. A four-person team heading up into space, along with Isaac Min and Gillis, medical officer Anna Menon and mission pilot Scott Petit also on board. And around 7 a.m., the aircraft depressurizing, and the history was made. And the hatch is open. Isaacman and Gillis floating out along that extended Skywalker just beside the capsule. Menon and Petit inside to ensure everything ran according to plan. But the Dragon capsule has no airlock, so all four crew members were exposed to the vacuum of space. The Polaris mission also marks the first time the SpaceX engineered extravehicular activity spacesuits, or EVA, have been tested in space with hopes that one day we could use them for missions to Mars. The space company says on their website, building a base on the moon and a city on Mars will require thousands of spacesuits. The development of this suit and the execution of the EVA will be important steps toward a scalable design for spacesuits on future long-duration missions. And given this is a civilian mission of this four-person team, the billionaire Jared Isaacman is the only one who had ever been to space before. Two of the crew members, the two women on board, they'd actually spent years training other astronauts. But this is their first opportunity to go up into space. This is also the furthest any human has gone into space since the Apollo missions mm. more than 50 years ago. How exciting oh, for them. Amazing. Yeah. And the video, like, they have cameras on the helmets of the space of the space suits so you can see the earth. Oh, helmet cam? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Trevor, thank you.